Okay, very good. So point number six, automatically change elemental type content on autoplay. So this is a very nice one. We touched up on that at the start of our video, but let's discover this in more details now. So let's say we have three different tabs here like this. You know, they all look very nice, very professional. Perhaps you want to use this for your hero section or anywhere on your website and emphasize a few main important points. So you might want to have this to display on autoplay. So how can you enable this? Well, once you've created your section here, you go to extra options and right here at the bottom, you have autoplay. So if you enable this, as you can see now, you have a progress bar and it will automatically load the next one once it's gone past the five seconds. As you can see, the duration is five. So this is in seconds. So every five seconds, it will automatically load the next tab. Okay, so you have the autoplay here and then play pause button. If you enable this, it will display a small play and pause button underneath. So if I was to click on pause, once it's reached the five seconds, it will stop. And basically if I want to continue, I have to click play and then it will load the next one and so on and so on. Okay, so this is basically another option available to you if you wanted to use it. So next we have the duration, like we said, this is in seconds. This is the load time. You have the color of the progress bar. So basically click on this and then you can select any color you want. So let's go with red now, just to give you a quick example. So basically now our progress bar is in red and then you can change the thickness. So this is five pixels at the moment. So let's increase that to 10, as you can see much thicker, or you can have it turn up maybe let's say three. Okay, so that's basically it for the autoplay.